Hey guys, welcome to another video for Rafael that is the Redmi K20 Pro and this is a question I've been getting in a lot of live streams. How to install Siberia OS. I keep losing my recovery when installing Siberia OS. So I've decided that, you know, let's make one video which will guide all of you and you will not have any problems installing or updating Siberia OS. But before we get into all of that, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. In the description of each video, you will find the link to our Telegram community where you have more than a thousand like-minded people chatting with each other and having a lot of fun, so join us there. Last but not the least, if you think the hard work is worth the effort, please click on the join button and support the channel. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to PhoneOps. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right, so today we are going to flash the latest version of Siberia OS on the K20 Pro or the Mi 90 Pro. Now first, precautions that we need to take. Make sure you have more than 50% battery. You need an unlocked bootloader and the latest version of Orange Fox Recovery installed, which is linked in the description. At the same time, you need to make sure that all the data on your phone's internal storage has been backed up because we are going to format everything and we will be formatting the data partition to F2FS. So please be prepared for that and make sure you've backed up everything. Now, once you've done that, once you've taken care of all of that, there are just three files that you need apart from the recovery because I am assuming that you have the recovery installed, the one that is linked in the description. Right, so let's go ahead over here. You need the 12.0.6 Android 10 firmware. You don't need Android 11 firmware. I'm using Nick G apps basic over here and the latest version of Siberia, which is 4.7. Now, once you've taken care of all of these things, you need to follow instructions and you should be good to go. So the first thing that we will do is of course, we will boot into TWRP that is Orange Fox Recovery. Now in case you are on a different TWRP before you follow this particular step, I will highly recommend you first move to the latest version of Orange Fox as I mentioned twice by now because that plays a very very important role. Now as you can see over here we are in Orange Fox in case you are encrypted it will ask you to enter your lock screen password so please go ahead and do that right now we have the files in the phone's internal memory so we will not be wiping internal storage all right so the first thing to do over here is you need to first go ahead and directly flash the rafael firmware based on android 10 no matter what rom you're coming from just go ahead and do this so let's flash this Now follow this step by step because this will ensure you don't lose your recovery, you don't enter a boot loop, you don't have any problems at all, right? Now the next step to do is to go to wipe and just wipe system. Now remember we are following instructions as instructed by the Siberia developer and that is the reason we are not going to have any problems. Now is the time to flash the ROM. So go over here and select the ROM, flash this. Let's wait for the ROM to flash completely. It will take about 45 seconds to a minute. These are fast devices, 855 and above. It won't take a very, very long time. Let's wait for the ROM to flash. All right, now as you can see over here, the ROM has flashed. So just make sure you don't get any errors, right? Now, once you've ensured that, the next thing to do is flash G apps, Majisk, Micro G, whatever you want. In our case, we'll be flashing G apps because this ROM doesn't come with G apps. So we are flashing Nick G apps basic. That is the package I prefer. So let's go ahead and flash that. All right. Now, once that has been flashed, go to wipe and wipe the cache first. Okay. Now go to the main screen, go to the menu over here, go to manage partitions, select the data partition, tick mark, change file system, select F2FS, swipe to change. Okay, now everything is done. So let's go ahead and do a reboot. Now, as you can see, you already have the Siberia logo. We will wait for the ROM to boot up. We will skip the setup and then we will boot into Orange Fox Recovery again. All right, so just like that, we are on the home screen. For some reason, it did not give me the Android setup part, which is absolutely fine. We still have the Play Store installed. And let's maybe reduce the brightness a little bit and Let's go to about phone over here. As you can see, if we go to the Android version, Siberia 4.7, Soviet star kernel, Play Store installed, and you do have Gcam included as well. There you go. 
Yep, everything working as expected. Now let's see if the TWRP recovery is still there. So let's go to recovery here. Now remember, always follow this particular method of flashing ROMs if you want to do a clean flash. I think uh, if there is an update and if it is mentioned in the update that you can dirty flash over the present version, you can go ahead and dirty flash as well. Now, as you can see over here, we have booted into Orange Fox recovery. That means we have not only flashed Siberia, our recovery is intact and we did not get encrypted as well. So let's go to system and everything seems perfect. So this was a quick step-by-step -step guide for K20 Pro and Mi 90 Pro users to install Siberia OS without losing the recovery or without entering fast boot and stuff. Follow the instructions. The files are linked in the description. Let me know in the comment section if you like this video and please subscribe if you have not. Until the next one, this is Kailash signing off at PhoneOps. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.